Hey guys, it's Madame Moria. Welcome back to more Let's Play Cooking Mama Cook-Off, where we are in the final week of the Let's Play. Oh my gosh, and we're starting with America. Oh my god. Um, yeah, this dorky dude that looks like Dennis the Menace. And Waldo. He looks like Where's Waldo's younger sibling or son, I really don't know, mixed with Dennis the Menace, so it's pretty pretty appetizing, right? Alright, so we're going to be making the hot dog today, and we all remember how accurate this recipe is. And then we're going to be making cake. So. Oh, hi! Wow, look at this. Two whole st Ooh. Two whole steps compared to every other country's 20 million steps and probably the most non... What is this? Las Vegas? This does not sound like typical American traditional music. Oh my god, guys. That was so tough. Ugh. Yep. This is pretty pathetic for America. Just, just saying. It's nothing personal, just... Why is this a thing? I will never get it. <sighs> really? I mean, like, how many toppings do you need on a freaking hot dog, number one? Number two, what are these toppings? I'm just gonna say that America wins the fail contest in this game for who can be the most inaccurately Oh no! Uh, oh! Are you serious? Yeah, who can be the most inaccurately interpreted country? America. But I love it. These recipes are amazing because of that. Sweet! Clear time, one second! Oh, screw you! You're just stupid. No one likes you. Ooh, but we got a present for the kitchen. A present in kitchen. I'm going to put a present in kitchen. That's great, Mama. You're really cool. Um, okay, well, that was pathetic. Let's actually try and do something worthwhile this time. Um, yay, and we get more than, like, two steps. I'm so impressed right now. So anyway, it is the final week of the Let's Play, and I'm very excited to be concluding this game because I feel like it's been an incredibly smooth run and just really, really fun. Like, this has not been a Let's Play that's been like, oh my gosh, a stress fest at certain times, which is great because um, I have trouble handing, handling stress fests in that way. When you reach a point in a game where you're like, okay, this is the part that's like a lull or whatever. I mean, this game's not really set up to be like that, but because of that, it makes it a very smooth, playable game in sequences, if that makes sense. I'm sure that, like, you guys have watched some pretty complicated Let's Plays of, like, RPGs or even just, like, platformers, and sometimes it's hard to know when to, like, take a breather or stop with those, and not like the Let's Play, but just in general as you're playing, it's like, okay, I've shown this much off, but how much more should I show off before... You know, it's just weird. It's all about timing. And this game, let's put it that way, was very easy to time. So, and it worked very well. Um, I didn't have any sort of, like, problems with uploading, because sometimes that can become an issue when a game, like, progresses really smoothly and then has a really heavy, like, center or end that's just like, uh, what do we do with this, you know? So, in other words, I'm just really satisfied with how this Let's Play has been consistent because I feel like that's something that's been lacking on my channel so I'm just like I'm proud of myself and I'm so proud of you guys for sticking by me or thankful for you guys I can't be like oh I'm so proud of you for I'm just proud of you guys for being pimps but I am very happy that you guys have seemed to enjoy this let's play and really been super supportive in multiple ways 
So, I just want to say thank you, really. Especially in this final week. Are you serious? Um, I love that his went over... Overboard. Overflowing! And he did it again, so... Three guesses whose score is gonna be better this time. Ooh, bonus! Seriously, what is this music, though? This is not American. Good job. Oh, how'd he get a bonus? He screwed up twice! Oh, how dumb. You just gave him a bonus because you felt sorry for him. We don't get feel sorry for me bonuses. Ugh, oh, so lame. Um, and he, like, burnt his, kind of, so that's not good. But mine- well, it is good, but mine is very good! Sorry, dude! Your freaking American weirdness can't hold up to this American! I know, I'm just so passionate, you guys. So passionate. Oh my gosh, so it's that week, again, where it's like the week between my birthday, which is like, for me, my personal start to the holiday season, just because it happens first, and then it's like all the holidays follow, awesome. which I love. Um, but anyway, it's that in-between week where it's like, okay, my birthday's been over for a little bit, or about, you know, a week, essentially. And there's like a week until Halloween. So it's like the perfect in between like preparation period where it's like I just came off a high and I'm entering another high. Wow, look at that decorating job. Well, we clearly didn't do that, so cool. But that is our top score. Oh my god, just mama decided to decorate it for us, I guess. Oh man. Ooh, fun golden utensils. Yeah, that's great. Thanks. Okay, so that's going to do it for America. But we'll be back next time with Germany and what looks like Albert Einstein, which is kind of terrifying. All right, see you guys then. Peace out.